Hi you guys, Lindsay here. Well, welcome back to my channel, Inside the Him. Which the next one, two, three, four are all going to utilize fabric scraps, which is great. So the first one of those is this adorable little embroidery hook, uh, embroidery hoop ornament. So you can find these super small embroidery hoops at the craft store. These are three inches, I believe, and that was the smallest that I could find. I did find one and a half inch ones online, but they were fairly expensive. So I just opted for the three inch ones. Again, if you've got a small tree like me, you really only need a couple of these to hang at the bottom. If you've got a normal size floor to ceiling Christmas tree, you could buy these three inch ones and make a ton of them and just disperse them all around your tree and it would be really beautiful. Um, you can also buy even larger ones if you have like, you know, those oversized vintage ornaments, that would be really cool as well. But for inside my embroidery hoop, I just used a bit of fabric. I did put a little bit of batting in the back just to give it a little bit of stability. And then I used my Cricut Maker to cut out some iron-on vinyl. So I couldn't not make a pun with sewing and snow. So I, my all my sayings are related to like a pun on the words so and snow. So I've got a sew flake, I've got let it sew, and I've got missile sew, which I thought was really cute. So you can put in your family members' names, you can put in, I mean, little different Christmas sayings, little Bible verses, you know, whatever it is that speaks to you for the holidays, whatever kind of your theme for your tree is, you can utilize these little words here to kind of give that a little bit more punch and kind of drive that message home a little bit. But yeah, it, they're super simple to make. You literally just iron on the saying, stick the fabric in the embroidery hoop and you're good to go. I did almost, almost stain the wooden uh, embroidery hoop to give it a little bit more of that rustic feel. But as of right now, you can see it's still the natural color of the embroidery hoop. We'll see if I end up getting the stain out or not, but for now, that's that. 